Hi, y'all. I think it's a Wednesday the 5th. I'm not really sure, as usual. Um, I'm on my way to Lowe's. Y'all know I had that really pretty piece of maple or whatever it was called for my floor back here. And Jerry talked me into taking it back. Well, guess where I'm going? That's right. I'm going to get it back. Now, I'm going to tell you one of the biggest reasons that I am. And her channel is called Happy, H-A-P-I, Camper. And yeah, I've talked about her before. <sighs> And I have waited and waited to see what she was going to do with her floor this time. Well, now I know. I saw her video. You guys go over there and watch her videos. They are so, I mean, why don't I have skills like that? I would come up missing a finger. Because I do have access to all the tools I need. Leo has plenty of them. But anyway, Winter, Ms. Happy Camper, finally put out her video on her floor. And I love it. I can do this by myself. I can. Or, you know, I get Chico to help me. I mean, actually... Lowe's is going to slide that piece of wood right in the back of my van. There is something back there kind of uh, blocking the way, and I'm not going to give that away because I'm going to give this van thing to you all in bites. Bites? Little bites? Oh, wait a minute. Where am I? I think I'm supposed to turn right here. That's okay, I can turn up there. Um, see, I don't usually go this way. Rancho Villa Road. No, I don't go this way. But anyway, um, so, now I am going to get started on mine. And I will try to film it. But you know what? Okay, this is the one. If y'all watch... Old Grove Road, that's where Lowe's is. If you watch Winter's video on her floor, you'll see. I can use a drill. I can do that. And I can stick wood under wood. I can do that. The thing that I have to do is measure again and uh, for my uh, trap door back there in the very back where the storage area is. And I'm gonna see if I can sweet talk one of those guys. Look at these stop signs. Can y'all see that? I don't know if you can or not. I can see them, but anyway. Um, I'm going to see if I can stop one of those gentlemen, if they're not busy, to come out and measure for me and see if what I measure matches up with his. Y'all, I can't talk, I can't sew, I can't walk, I can't chew gum, I bite myself. I bit myself in the cheek last night sometime. Um, let's see. So, that's what I am up to right now. I am so relieved. I've been working like crazy in my yard trying to get my small stuff consolidated. And um, I'm almost there. But um, now... This is a different subject. Where are we at? Oh, five minutes. Um, 
Jerry was over a couple of days ago and he got up off the couch and he went outside. And so I wasn't paying any attention. And in a couple minutes, well, it wasn't even that long, he comes in and he's holding his hand up to me like that. He said, don't look, don't look. And I was like, oh, my girl has got another poor lizard. I sure hope that other one that lost almost his whole tail is getting it back. But let me tell y'all. I'll tell you before I tell you this. I'll tell you that first. And then I'll tell you this. She uh, is no longer allowed outside without her mommy at all. And she's miserable. Do y'all know what she had this time? She had a baby rabbit. Now, it wasn't a baby newborn rabbit. It was actually the size of a kitten. And so, she dropped the little rabbit back by the bathroom, and Jerry grabbed her up, because the poor little rabbit was just, you know, he was scared. He, he, he didn't know where the exit was. So, he gave Lily to me and said, now you stay right there. And I said, what is it? He said, it's a little rabbit. I'm going to catch it and put it outside. It's fine. It is not hurt. I said, okay. That little rabbit, I put Lily in the bathroom. And that little rabbit was the cutest little thing, y'all. It was the size of a little kitten, like, like an eight-week-old kitten. She didn't hurt it. Jerry said she was carrying it in her mouth like a kitten. Now, if she really wanted to hurt that little rabbit, she could have. Pro parking. Okay, that's me. Anyway, y'all, I was crying and crying and crying and, and, uh, poor Lily. She just, I mean, she cannot help it, y'all. If I had a little travel trailer, I'd go out in the country somewhere and live and let her just run around like a wild cat. But I can't do that because then I'd be afraid a predator would get her. Now, when I lived out in the country, our dogs and cats, neither one really um, got taken off. I don't, you know, I don't know why that was, but they didn't. Um, but there's so many animals now, y'all. They have no place to go. They have no place to live. They have no food. And it's disgusting. But anyway, uh, rest assured, from now on, Jerry came over and uh, I threw a pizza in the oven and I said, one of us has got to stay out here with the kids because he had brought Toby over. And um, he said, I'll sit out here. I'll sit out here and babysit. And poor Lily, she just begs me to go outside. This morning, she got up on the bed and I had already fed her and everything. And she was sitting there meowing and I was trying to ignore her. I got a bite. I think I have fleas. But um, 
So she jumped up on the bed and with her cold little nose, she was just giving me little kisses. It broke my heart. I should have got up out of my bed and put my robe on and went outside and sat with her for a little bit. I will tomorrow. We're going to work in the yard tomorrow. But um, I think we're going to put some two foot high chicken wire down all along the bottom of my fence because that baby rabbit got in the fence. The big ones can't, but the baby one did. And I'll finish this up. We were in there this morning and um, I was going to go outside for a few minutes. And so Lily was sitting looking out towards Leah and Maria's looking out the window. And I said, Lily, Lily. I mean, she was zoomed. I went over there. There was a rabbit sitting right there in Leo and Maria's driveway. We have a ton of them, y'all. And I've got grass out there that because the birds drop the seeds, grass grows. So I am going to pull up that grass and then I'm soaking it with vinegar. And I'm going to stay on top of that. So those little rabbits won't be tempted to come over. Because they have. I've seen their little poopies. Oh, y'all. That just makes me feel so bad. How many cats have... I mean, on the farm, yes. They didn't get much to eat. Scraps. And they went out to the barn and got mice. Lily just, I mean, she's amazing to me. Now, I am not going to do this. I am not, I am not serious. But I am telling you, she would be the best mouser. Although she hasn't hurt, well, she did hurt the little hummingbird. But it was so delicate, that's why. Um... But I don't know if she would, she'd be good at catching them, but I don't know that she would kill them. She might. I don't know. But why does my cat have to have... <gasps> Ooh, that was ladylike. <laughs> I'm a one sneeze woman. I only sneeze once at a time. But, um... Anyway, I don't understand why my little girl has to be like that. Toby, if he saw a lizard, he'd be scared of it. He'd be terrified. If he saw a rabbit, he would really just come apart. Now, why can't Lily be like that? But I love that girl to death, and I just have to, you know, I just have to make sure. Anyway, y'all, love you. I'm going to get this video out, but I'm telling y'all, go over to Happy H-A-P-I Camper and watch how she's doing her van. If I had skills like that, y'all look at her shelves that she has up. Y'all look at those. I mean, when she gets done this time, I mean, it's looked good before, but this time it is going to be amazing. And, uh, Winter. Oh, y'all, she did the biggest shout out. Right in the beginning of her video, she said, and this is for you, Deborah Joy. <laughs> y'all, I have bug that woman mercilessly. Is that how you say that? Mercilessly. Anyway, really bad. When are you going to do your floor? Blah, 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 blah. Come on, hurry up. I, you know, blah, blah, blah. So, I am finally here getting my wood. I'm going to get 
some hinges. Uh, I don't know how many two by fours I need, but I don't know. I'll get a couple. But um, anyway, I'll start trying to, you know, film this when I get started on it. And I am terrible at it. But hey, we're used to that. Love y'all. Do something fun today and make yourself happy. That's what I'm doing. Jerry's not making me happy. Bless his heart, I have to say, though. It has been horrible getting his mom situated in assisted living. I think she's kind of a demanding lady. Anyway, love you. Gotta go. Getting hot in the van. I'll talk to you later. Bye now.